Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is a uh, quick tips and tricks video for anybody that is using Narrator. If you are disabled and need to have Narrator to read out text on your screen uh, and help you out when you actually use Windows 10, well, the May 2019 update has a pretty major update to the features of Narrator, but not just in the features themselves, but also in the way that it handles the reading of your screen. One of the biggest problems with the Narrator is that it's been implemented for a long time. It's not been tweaked for a long time. So it was okay, but I'm pretty sure a lot of you probably found it somewhat crappy. And as a tech guy, I've seen a lot of people actually use software that would read for them rather than Narrator in Windows, simply because Narrator was too annoying. So they actually did a lot of work in the past couple of versions of Windows 10 on Narrator. So when you want to use the Narrator, of course, it's in the settings that you have all of this. In the settings, you have Ease of Access. And on the left side, you'll see Narrator. Narrator can be turned on and used on your computer. Mouse mode on. So here you go. So you got. We've updated the narrator keyboard layout so it more closely matches the experience you may have had with a settings window. And allow the shortcut key to start narrator checkbox checked. So it's a little, a little better in, you know, when you go around with the mouse pointer, for example, around the screen and actually having specific items read out to you. It does a better job at doing this. There's also something new. There's actually a few new options in here. Show when narrator home when narrator starts checkbox checked. So you have different options. You have that little rectangle that you see here when there's text inside that rectangle. It's actually going to read to you uh, the text that is in that rectangle. One of the things also is you can change the voice as usual. That was also already Personalize there. narrator's voice. So choose a voice. Different languages. Close button collapsed and, and you have also um, if you have several languages installed it will read in different languages for you uh, so there's a lot of uh, new things in here I think you should actually go through the narrator and have it actually do a job use narrator exiting narrator and, and use it a little more if you haven't used narrator in a long time it's much better you can also use the shortcut so if you want to turn narrator on or off the Windows control and enter key so Windows CTRL and enter. Mouse mode on. Windows CTRL enter. Exiting narrator. And you can actually exit or turn on narrator with the shortcuts. You don't have to go into the settings all the time. Also, there are some options in here. There's uh, the pitch, the volume, the speed of the voice, uh, and of course, how the um, volume controls. And there's a lot more settings actually in here and the way that it can actually read to you, even hearing phonetics uh, when you need to actually understand something that maybe you're not getting right. So Narrator is actually much improved with the May 2019 update. And look at all of these settings, so many, so many more settings than, than before in Narrator. So um, basically, this is a good uh, option to use on your computer, the uh, Windows 10 Narrator. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.